friends. Welcome to Joy in the Making, episode number 10 on the Lullaby Dreams Baby Blanket. If you'll remember, last week I showed you not only the progress I had made, but we have now made Joy in the Making interactive and we spun a wheel to see how many colors of the three colors left I needed to add to the blanket and the wheel chose all three colors. And so then I asked you to put in the comment section below, yes, if you thought I could get all three colors done, no, if you thought I couldn't. And so we are going to take a look at those answers in just a minute. But you individually know if you answered and what your answer was. So let's see. Did I successfully get all three colors added or did I not successfully get all three colors added? And the answer is... Dun, 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 dun. I got all three colors successfully added. When we left off, I was like right in here, just starting this color here. So I finished this color, I finished this color, and I finished this color. So I did get all three colors added. So now the body of the blanket is completely finished. And so now all I have to do is add the border. And since the border is the only thing that needs to be added to the blanket, um, I am not going to spin the wheel because that is my challenge. My challenge is to get the border completed for this coming week. All right, so I'm going to pause the video for a minute and take you over to the wheel and I'll tell you what happens when we get over there. Here is our joy in the making answer wheel and we had six people that answered yes or no and that was Tiffany with Little Crafty Bits, Angela Wright, Sanja I Love Crochet, Samantha Stewart, Tina with Camper 14 and Carla Gordon. Thank you ladies for all of your answers and your participation. And as we know, I did get to get all three colors completed. So yes was the correct answer. So for this week, I do have to remove Tina's name because she answered no. And she said that with the holiday, she wasn't sure that I would get them done. And Tina, I wasn't sure I was going to get it done either, but I did. So let me remove her name. And now all those that answered yes are left on the wheel and we're going to spin the wheel and whoever's name the wheel chooses, we're going to add them to the big wheel and at the end of the quarter, that means at the end of September, we will spin the wheel and choose a winner. So good luck. Let's see who the wheel chooses for tonight. <laughs> And congratulations, it was Samantha. So congratulations, Samantha. So let me remove her name. And then we're also going to remove everyone else's name because this week will start fresh. And now let me save this. And we're now going to open up the big winner wheel. And we're going to add Samantha. And this is 7, 8, 24. Let me see. Let me just do it like this. July 8th is when her name went on this wheel. And then we're going to save it. And that is how this is going to work. Well, thank you for joining me for this Joy in the Making. 
I hope that I can get the border done. Um, so again, in the comment section, let me know, yes or no, if you think I will be able to complete the entire border around the baby blanket. All right, be joyful, stay crafty in your own way, make your own joyful creations, and above everything else, remember you are important, you are loved, and be an exclamation. All right, nugs and joy. Mwah. See you in the next Joy in the Making video. Hey.